Hey, Kelp here with Wild Curiosity. Today we're down at the beautiful Santa Rosa Creek getting curious about crayfish, otherwise known as crawfish, crawdads, mud bugs, and yabbies. So come follow us, let's get curious. exploring today is in Northwest Santa Rosa. Santa Rosa is a city north of San Francisco and is full of amazing wildlife if you truly know where to look. Crayfish are freshwater crustaceans and oftentimes sensitive to pollutions. However, our non-native Louisiana crayfish that we have here today is hardier and more resilient, allowing it to truly survive in a harsher environment. Crayfish come in three different colors. Most commonly we see is red, the next is blue, and the most rare is white. As you can see here on this crayfish, it's missing one of its claws, but not to worry. Crayfish can actually regrow limbs that they lose, which is particularly useful for males during mating season, where they fight each other to display dominance. Crayfish breathe through feather-like gills that are located underneath their exoskeleton. These extract oxygen from the water. The fun thing is that they can also breathe air as long as their gills remain wet. All crayfish have a protective exoskeleton made up of chitin, which actually doesn't grow over time, eventually forcing them to molt, revealing a soft new exoskeleton underneath that will solidify over time. The crayfish habitat is awesome to explore, and as we enter it, we are sure to be respectful of all living things, being careful to leave no trace behind. Thank you for staying curious. If you wanna know anything else about our content today, check out the links below. As always, like, subscribe, and stay tuned for more content. If you wanna see an awesome video by Brave Wilderness where they discover a new species of blue crayfish in West Virginia, check out the link below.